Thank you, sir. Time now for this hour's car review. Had a chance to drive the 2023 Lexus ES350. Here are the trim levels that are available. It starts off as the ES350. That's the base trim level. Then it goes to Luxury, Ultra Luxury, F-Sport Design, and F-Sport Handling. I had the F-Sport H, which stands for Handling. This is a compact sedan, seats five people, including the driver, all new for 2019. Spindle grille with lots of sharp angled lighting features. Fast back sedan design, very swoopy and very aero. F-Sport includes trunk-mounted spoiler, yep, on a Lexus, on an ES. Uh, chrome dual exhaust tips mounted in the aero valance panel. What I liked about it, the overall look, very swoopy. A long four-door saloon. Ooh, what could use improvement? Nothing. Interior highlights. Beautiful new 12-inch infotainment touchscreen. And I want to underscore that because they have finally... Got rid of the mouse pad on the... <sighs> yes. Thank it, you, it, Lexus. It, thank you. The dash has angled design elements that mix well with its features. Wrap around, comfortable bucket seats. Mark Levinson sound system. This thing is just awesome. Trunk room, large, with a uh, kind of a small opening, but that's just the way that these hmm. cars are these days. What I liked about it, no more touchpad controller for the infotainment system. Way to go, Lexus. What could use improvement? Help me find something. I can't find anything. I just love this car. 3.5 liter V6 engine. More horsepower. <clears throat> nope. 302 horsepower, 267 pound-feet of torque, eight-speed automatic transmission. It's rated for 22 miles per gallon in the city, 31 on the highway, for a combined of 25. I got 27.7 miles per gallon, wow. over 423.9 miles. What I liked, perfectly matched power and transmission. Well, that's good. Don't change it. Ride and handling. Controllable, luxurious ride quality swoopy that's what he said but a but swoopy not saloon <clears throat> yeah but not not a uh, big cush machine like the old buicks you need know, just kind of float across no it wasn't it all very controlled pricing base trim price is 47 8 to me that's a bargain my friend <clears throat> that's the trim price mm-hmm. Prices tested fifty three seven seventy five. Still not, not a big bad jump. at all. Yeah. yeah. Base model price forty one four forty for a Lexus. For a Lexus ES three fifty. Competitors: the Acura TLX for thirty nine eight fifty, the Volvo S sixty for forty one three hundred, and the Audi A four for thirty nine nine. All right there in yep. that sweet spot. And uh, I liked it. I like the affordability of it, and I love the luxury of it. Uh, and I am typically not necessarily going toward the luxury bottle. I, Don Armstrong, would buy this car. It's a nice car. I would buy that car. If somebody would loan you the money. <laughs> well, for 53 that's really not bad. That's, that's, not, that's no. no, it's not bad at all. No. Uh, most SUVs these days, you know, oh, well north of that, well north of sixty five. This least, thing yeah. is so sweet, sweet. Mm-mm-mm. You know, I got a birthday coming up, Mike. 